SmackDown in the courtroom! Courtroom exchange of the day. Attorney, doctor, have you perf before you performed the autopsy, did you check for a pulse? Witness, no. Check for blood pressure, no. Check for breathing, no. So is it possible that the patient was alive when you began the autopsy? No. How could you be so sure, doctor? Because his braid was sitting on my desk in a jar. But could the patient have still been alive nonetheless? Yes, it is possible he could have been alive and practicing <laughs> Oh, God. God, you, I, you probably did have to do him like that, but that is just brutal. Are we sure it's not his brain that's inside the jar? Hello everybody and welcome to Calbus! My name is Lumo and today we are looking at r slash hold up a subreddit dedicated to things just make it double take things that make you really question did you really just say that? Let's just get right into it. What is it? Last night I bond burgered your sister. When I find the guy that James Bond burgered my sister last night I'll be real I have no idea what this is supposed to be saying. I genuinely don't. I haven't been able to figure out figure out. I haven't been able to figure out what it's supposed to mean. Do the, do the comments have anything? I it was supposed to be silently pounded. How is, am I supposed to recognize a like one pound burger by sight? I get that I'm American, but that feels like a little bit of a stretch. Oops, forgot the filter. All right, pretty normal looking woman. Wow, that is, that is shockingly effective at what it does, but also incredibly intriguing. Like genuine, the AI has come so far to the point where we can do stuff like this on our phone in real time. And I think that is fascinating. One last laugh from beyond the grave. After my funeral, I want one of my friends to take my phone and text everyone, thanks for coming. Honestly, that's powerful. That's genuinely powerful. Look, when I go down, when it's finally my time, someone needs to be at my funeral and halfway through the procession march, start blasting the Shadow the Hedgehog's credit theme and then hide my coffin somehow. Because I'm never turning back. I can't, I'm dead. But someone needs to make the prank happen. The corpse needs to leave and just meet everyone else at the graveyard. However, before that point happens, you should comment, like, and subscribe in that order. I'll know if you do it out of order. So come on, what are you waiting for? Leave that comment, then a like, then subscribe, turn that button gray, like the matter in our brains. We done? Good, let's keep going. Hold up, Lord of the Rings. Sam being able to carry Frodo and not be affected by the ring means the ring doesn't understand transitive properties, so they could have just taped the ring to a mouse, then carried the mouse with no ill effects. Whole thing would have taken 20 minutes. I'll be real, I don't blame people for not understanding the properties of a magical circlet that causes genuine suffering and also invisibility. I never understood why they were like, it's the ring of power. I, who used it for power? It just turns you invisible. Like I watched these movies when I was but a wee baby, but I don't remember them doing anything else besides turn you invisible and make you obsessive. One to end them all. Yesterday, I asked my 12 year old son what other kids think about him having two dads. His response, they don't care, but they don't like how I'm immune to yo mama jokes. <laughs> yo mama's so ugly, yo dad had to get a husband. <laughs> Ah, uh, that's good. That's so powerful. That is a superpower in unto itself. Your move, Blondie. Go to the dance with you. Yeah, <laughs> I'm, I'm like way out of your league, but I'm sure some girl would want to go with you. Like your mom or something. Quit it with that smirk. There's nothing cool about bringing your mom. <laughs> okay, we got to we gotta talk about this art style here because someone is down bad for MILFs. And I get it, but it's very publicly on display on YouTube now. And I just, I hope you're okay with that. I'm sure you probably are because you posted this publicly, but just come on. The comments, yo, this mom's got a 90 degree back curve. You can set a drink on it. Um, at Minions, is it true you guys used to work for Himmler? <laughs> no, silly. We only work for villains. This, I refuse to believe this is real. I refuse to believe this is real. There is no way that this marketing department was so incompetent. Apparently, conveniently, through the period of World War II, the minions were frozen in ice or something. <laughs> like, they, they had a reason ready to go for this. Birthday cards! I've opened up three birthday cards and I'm already 150 euros up. I love being a postman. <laughs> oh my god. I know that this is illegal and it's a felony, but I also just love the concept of some dude going through every birthday card like, Yes. Yes, now I can play the gotcha in Arknights. 
No one can stop me. Stealing children's money to play gotcha games. Can you go away? Probably the most brutal interview yet. I stole her earrings when she was in sixth grade. Okay, rude. That was you? I couldn't keep them though, I gave it to my cousin. What's oh. something you've done she doesn't know about? I f***ed her boyfriend two years ago. Is that why you <laughs> broke up? Why? <laughs> I'm sorry, can you go away? <laughs> I'm sorry, can you go away? I mean, that, look, here's the thing. If someone's willing to admit that, they either want it off their shoulders or they genuinely think it'll be a non-issue. Unfortunately, it is probably the first one because by God, or, or she was just going for the fatality because the earrings were stolen. I don't know. I'm no sociologist, but this is a very uncomfortable exchange and we're leaving. I wonder what happened. Jamia Jamil injured her butthole while filming She-Hulk. Okay. I, I guess, I don't know. This seems like something that we shouldn't exactly get into. I, I guess Hulk, Hulk moments. I, I don't, I don't know. I don't know. Mom, have you caught that filthy rat? Me. All right. <laughs> Yo, little, 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 little girls dancing. Little, just having a little fun, doing a little pose, doing a little wiggle. Rats are some of the chillest and most like comfortable creatures, I swear. Once you gain their trust, it's very hard to betray, I think, because like, there's not a lot of resistance here. This little dude's just letting it happen. But what a cute little mouse, what a cute little rat -o. Little what a little guy, I wonder if he's gonna boggle after. What a little, little, little spunkalo. Nice save, soldier, also women. Do you like anyone? Yeah, you. Uh, I have a boyfriend. Y yeah, you? <laughs> oh, thank God. Yeah, no, I'm single and I don't have anyone I like. You can just say no. You don't have to lie. That's a very uncomfortable thing. That, this summit, it's just uncomfortable. Don't hide, fight. Say what's real. Don't just come up with BS to avoid an uncomfortable conversation. You will have many in your life. Get good at having them. This pan looks neat. All right, cool pan. What's gonna happen? Pretending to do a little eggy flip. I'm so, so confused. <laughs> okay, well, one's getting its intended use and the other is being used for cooking. Something, <laughs> something about this just absolutely slays me because she's like, she's aiming down. She's not aiming up. Whoever she's hitting with this pan, she's expecting them to be in like a compromised and unoptimal position for fighting. And that's the scary part. A different type of rage quit. All right. Just flip in the, uh, not, it's not happening, is it? Oh, well, I had a feeling it was going to go there, but I didn't expect it to be so violent. My God. Best comment gets an award. Ew, you buy Reddit gold? Cringe. A long time ago, we had empires run by emperors. We had kingdoms run by kings, and now we have countries. I've been looking forward to this. Wow. Bravo! You've managed to crop the minion out of this Facebook meme. This is, this feels like it was posted by like a 60 year old dude who doesn't understand how to do Photoshop to make text. So he wrote it on a blackboard. Like, I don't know. This just it feels very like low quality. Oh yeah, and then saying best cannon gets an award to try and increase engagement. Like, that's off. That's so annoying. Growl, I'm a hunter. Hunter, but making it vegan. Girl didn't know the word for gathering. Yeah, this sounds about right, but look at that profile picture. She's clearly like five. I can't say as though I blame her for not having a full control over the English lexicon. Shouldn't be on Twitter though. I think the minimum age is 13, which is very unfortunate that we can be subjected to the opinions of 13 year olds at any time. I think that's a war crime, but nevertheless. 10G internet. That doesn't seem great, but it's also visually really cool. It's Okay, I'm sorry. It's It was playing one of Snoop's dog's song, but it just stopped and it's the double D. I can't believe that Ed and Nettie's Ed would do this. This is just, it, it kills me. That's really cool though. I love the dynamics of smoke. It's fascinating. And that's all the time we have here today on Calibus. If you like this, make sure to subscribe, leave a like, maybe share this with a friend who could use a reminder that, hey, leave the minion in your Facebook meme. God can't stop you. If you don't want more r slash hold up, there'll be another one popping up on your screen in just a couple of seconds. But until then, my name has been Lumo, and I hope to see you in the very next Calibus video. Have a great rest of your day.